Boxing King Media in association with Box Draw, uh, with Mr. Jeff Powell of the Daily Mail. What's your reaction to Joe Joyce's uh, fourth round knockout? Oh, well, it was fun while it lasted, and he had to take some huge shots. He's not only a man who can knock people out, but he's a man who's got a chin to stop himself being knocked out. Hammer went for broke from the start, landed some huge rights and lefts, but principally heavy hammering <laughs> right-handers, and Joe took the shots fantastic, and, and his, he didn't only hit hammers at the head, but he hit him to the body, and that proved decisive in the end. <coughs> that was what... Uh, uh, settled the, the knockdowns. So it was good, it was exciting. He needed to fight. He's been out of the ring for a year. And um, that, that was a, a wake up call as, as well as a, a, what we call in the drinking trade a livener. <laughs> Definitely. You know, in your history, of, in your experience of boxing, what kind of fighters can you compare him to from, from the past, as in heavyweights, who could just walk their opponents down and kind of just break their will and take shots on the way in? Um, no, he's. Uh, one of the reasons he has to do that is, is he doesn't have any defensive elusiveness. And uh, the, you know, he's, only, he's got limited experience at the moment for a man of his age. He needs to learn to move the head a bit. I mean, Mike Tyson would knock your head off, but he made pretty sure he didn't get his head knocked off. He was tremendous at the bobbing and weaving. So I don't think we can compare him yet with any of the greats, but he's a dangerous item. The juggernaut can be hit, but he can't be stopped at the moment.